Monique is multiplying down on claims that Oprah Winfrey and Tyler Perry had her, repudiated, from Hollywood, and presently she's likewise focusing on Tiffany Haddish over a past dig. Welcome viewers to my channel, please subscribe, like my video and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next update. The Institute Grant Victor did as such during a touchy new meeting with Shannon Sharp on his Club Shea digital recording. She has been at odds with Perry and Winfrey since 2009. She recently guaranteed that her refusal to advance their movie Valuable, for nothing, as well as overlooking Perry, Winfrey and Chief Lee Daniels from her 2010 Oscars discourse brought about her being boycotted. Monique is presently guaranteeing that she has sound of Perry admitting to her via telephone that he was the person who began the talk that she's challenging to work with. She likewise claimed that Perry conceded he was off base, and told her that he intended to justify her openly after his 2016 film Boo Hit Theaters. Sharp affirmed that he heard the supposed sound for himself yet it was not played on the web recording. Monique demands that the manner in which she approached recording the call with Perry was legitimate. She guarantees that Oprah called her in front of the taping telling her that Gerald had connected with her about coming on the show to apologize, as well as to share how guardians can safeguard their kids from hunters. Oprah supposedly inquired as to whether she might want to go on the show, yet she declined in light of the fact that she believed nothing should do with Gerald. Monique said she respected Oprah for telling her that she would cancel the show completely if she didn't want her brother on it. Anyway she began seeing ads for the show and discovered that Gerald would be on the show, yet in addition her mom, father and other sibling. She guaranteed that Oprah never said they would have been on the show, and the entertainer was in a terrible spot with her mom. Monique then, at that point, proceeded to blame Oprah for apparently taking two film jobs from her after the valuable aftermath. She claimed that she was initially offered the roles of Gloria Gagne's in Lee Daniels' The Butler, 2013, and Richard Pryor's grandmother in Daniels' upcoming stand-up comedian biopic. The two jobs wound up going to Oprah. She hypothesized that the television symbol's status as an extremely rich person has made it more straightforward for her to get what she requests from film studios. The meeting emerged in the midst of Monique's calls to blacklist Netflix for their asserted orientation predisposition and variety inclinations the point at which it came to paying humorists for their stand-up specials. She claimed that her special only cost her $500,000, while male comedians like Dave Chappelle and Chris Rock received multi-million dollar payouts. She then filed a discrimination lawsuit in 2019 against the streamer. A Netflix spokesperson stated that the company takes any accusations of discrimination very seriously, and plan to fight the lawsuit in response to the suit. At the point when the issue was raised to Haddish by GQ, she answered with, my business run unique in relation to her business. I don't carry on with her life. I don't have that spouse of hers. This profoundly irritated Monique and she at long last terminated back at Haddish during her plunk down with Sharp, in any event, venturing to raise Haddish, late legitimate difficulties. At the point when that's what I saw, I was like Tiffany assuming you had a spouse like mine, then, you might not have two duis, Monique said. Haddish was captured early long stretches of November 24, 2023 in Beverly Slopes, California regarding DUI when officials found her resting in her auto with the motor running, which was stopped on the bustling Beverly Drive at that point. 